basically today I'm gonna to be reviewing this replica Vivian Westwood. Now, I'll leave the link to where I got this in the description. I got it from Etsy, this Etsy seller's reviews are literally five stars. I think he's got like six, five stars. Before buying it, I um, read the reviews and they were all perfect, like saying that they were one-to-one, -one. you can't tell the difference, like, and I, to be fair, I was skeptical at the start. And so I was like, it was 20 pounds, which is like insanely cheap. Um, it came with a box, it came with the necklace, the bag, the cloth, everything. It looked like the real thing from the pictures. Um, and so I was like, why not? I yolo 20 quid and it came in like, I think it was like three to five days. It arrived at my house. And yeah, basically it came and I couldn't have asked for a better product. Like I've had the real one and honestly, you put them side to side, you cannot tell the difference. Like it is that good. And like, and for 20 pound as well. Like it is, the real ones are about 150. I think they've even sold out in most places. So like, it's even hard to get them for retail. Um, and so, I mean, for 20 pound, you're pretty much getting the real thing. You can't really go wrong. And so let's take a look at this in a bit more depth, a bit more detail. So starting off with the package, it comes in a nice, pretty sure this is the legit um, Vivian Westwood bag that you'd get if you'd go into a shop or the Vivian Westwood store. This is what they'd give you. Um, also comes with a nice cloth. I think this is a dust cloth to wipe the necklace if it gets dirty or dusty or whatever. It has the Vivian Westwood logo on there. Um, moving on, you've got the grey box that it comes with. Now, if you look at Vivian Westwood online, it's quite hard to like actually see the packaging. There are a lot of different types, obviously, because of I think the Vivian Westwood changed their packaging like quite frequently, like maybe every year or something yeah i think this packaging is up to date i think this is what they currently vivian westwood will currently uh, package their items up like, like in the gray box with the cloth and the pink bag anyway moving on you open the box and you've got a little dust bag in there really good quality as well like it's not it doesn't feel tacky it feels sturdy like all the packaging as well like it feels it generally feels legit and this is the actual necklace so i think the dimensions are exactly the same as the real one it fits like a choker um i'll quickly zoom in and give you some close-up shots here um you look at pictures online and you can't tell the difference i mean the diamonds they look they glisten in the sun obviously they're probably not the real di like real diamonds, but I don't think Vivian Westwood has real diamonds in their necklaces anyway. The pearls, they're good. They don't tarnish. They don't like scrape off. Um, and the logos, I think with some replicas, they struggle with the clasp to get it spot on. And I think with this one, it looks exactly like the legit one. Um, it says the Vivian, you got the little Vivian Westwood logo there with the planet orb logo on the actual clasp um, if I were you I'd recommend not to actually go in the shower consistently with this necklace on only because you wouldn't really do that with the real one anyway you know like and because it's a replica you don't know how it's being built you don't know the build quality or um, you know maybe they haven't used stainless steel for the metal and the clasp but yeah like I said apart from that Apart from not, um, you know, wearing it in the shower repetitively, because eventually the necklace will tarnish. Um, it is a, literally a 10 out of 10 necklace. You, you know, if you're walking down the road, someone else has one, you have one, you compare them. Do you know what I mean? It's a 50-50 again, whether they're going to tell it's real. Yeah, like I said, like this rep has exceeded all of my expectations when I first saw it online. You know, it's come and... I can't tell the difference between a real and a fake and I've looked at hundreds of images online. Um, like I said, I previously had a real necklace and you cannot tell the difference. I'm not even joking. Like it is, it's scary how good this is. And so, like I said, I've left a uh, link in the description uh, to the seller who I bought this from on Etsy. 
Um, so if you want to go pick one up, then definitely go down and well, buy it. I previously had this item in my basket um, and then they sold out, which I was gutted for, but basically just sent them a message and they said that they, I basically just sent them a message and they said that they'd have some in stock within 10 days and then 10 days later, they had them in stock and I purchased one. So I'd say definitely go and cop yourself one. Um, if you like this video, then subscribe, like, leave a comment if you want to see anything else, unboxings, reviews, rep reviews, uh, real versus fake, and on that note,